Welcome everyone to one more session in data structures and algorithms tutorial series. In this particular session, we are going to look at insertion in a linked list. So let us begin. Let us begin with insertion in a linked list. I will, I will just uh, use a pen over here. Okay. So how to insert in a linked list? Suppose we have a linked list. Okay. Suppose we have a linked list over here. And yes, we have a linked list of length 4. Okay, we have a linked list of length 4. So, this is our linked list that we have created. Oops. Let me just. Okay, so this is our linked list. Okay, and we want to insert it. Okay, so there can be. One, one case okay case number one case number one case one when we want to insert insert at first okay we want to either insert at first or at end okay so here we can write insert insert at insert insert at First, okay, insert at first or at end, okay, insert at first or at end. So, it, it's very easy to insert at first or at end, okay. Suppose I want to insert at first, okay, I want to insert at first, this is our head, okay. This is our head. So, our head now will point over here. Okay. First of all, next of this will point to point over here. Okay. Just remember the step. This will be the step one. Okay. And then head will point over here. Okay. Then our, our head will point over here. So, this will be step two. Okay. So, that is insertion at end. Okay. Insertion at first and at end. Suppose this points to null okay suppose this points to null and we want to insert it at end we want to insert it at end then the step number one will be we may we want we will point this okay we will have next next of this particular node next of the last node point to this node as step number one and the next of last node Okay, next of the inserted node to point null. Okay, to point null. So, this will be step number 2. So, over here we have two steps. Okay, so that is first case. Now, let us look at second case. Okay, let us look at case, case 2. Insert in between, insert, insert. insert in between okay insert in between insert in between insertion in between so insertion in between also has two cases okay it has two sub cases so the first case will be first case will be insert by index okay insert by index okay and insert by node okay insert after a node so we have two cases over here but first of all let us see this case let us see this case in our visual studio code so let us open our visual studio code over here and you must be wondering what is the name of this color theme so this is edignite ngo theme okay just search over here edignite edignite ngo theme this is the theme that is made by Prince Verma sir and Illumini of Edignite. Okay. So, do install this theme in your Visual Studio code. Use it and rate the theme if you like it. Okay. So, let us, let us now look at insertion. Okay. But before we look at insertion, let us copy all the code of linked list. Let us copy all the code. Control A, Control C and Control V. 
okay let us copy all the code of the previous linked list over here okay and if you aren't aware how to create a linked list then do check out our previous video okay so this is our linked list okay this is our linked list where we have created five nodes okay and now we want to insert at first okay so over here over here let me just write insert at at first insert at first so this particular thing will return a pointer that is head okay so it will return a, a pointer struct node okay a struct node star insert at first okay struct node star insert at first and now first of all we need to have a new node okay we need to create a new node so we have allocated memory okay we have allocated a memory for our new node okay now we need to get the data of the new node okay so we will write new underscore node new underscore node and data data of the new node data of the new node will be equal to data okay data that is being fed to us and then then the next of the new node will point to head okay next of new node will point to head so over here next new node next new node next equal to head okay equal to head so uh, very much similar to what we have uh, we have discussed okay very much similar to what we we just discussed over here okay we discussed right over here so first we need to do this okay we need to get the data yes we need to store the data then we need to point the head okay the the new node to head or new node to first okay so let us move back to visual studio code okay let us move back to visual studio code and over here over here we will run the code but before we run it let us return our head okay so let us return or return new node okay return new node so now our head will be new node okay so let let me just write here we have traversed it okay so i will just print over here i will i will print over here print f print f and i will write percentage n before insertion okay before insertion and i will i will print after insertion okay after insertion and now we will initialize okay we will have head we will have head as insert at first insert at first then we will give pass head and we can pass 100 or we can pass 10 or let, let's say 101 okay let us pass 101 so what we have done first of all we have created a new node okay uh, first of all over here we have created it at by inserting at first let me press alt z to enable the wrap okay so first of all we have created that new node and we have uh, stored the data into that particular node after that for, uh, we have pointed uh, we have pointed this new node to head okay next of new node to head and then we have uh, we we have replaced okay the pointer at head we have replaced pointer at head to new node okay so this way we can create our new node and now let us uh, let us let us traverse it okay so let us traverse it okay we have uh, we have done it now let us let us run our code okay let us run our code so before insertion before insertion you see that element 1 was 45 but after insertion the element 1 became 101 okay it became 101 so this was about this was about insertion using insertion at first now let us look insertion look at insertion at end okay so over here we will just write insert at end insert insert at end okay 
and then we will create a struct okay it will it will return struct node okay it will return struct node insert insert add end insert add end insert add end okay then it will it will take head okay it will take head and it will take data okay it will take head and then it will take data okay so over here then it will create a new node okay new node and it will initialize data of new node to okay data of new node to data that is passed into the function okay so it is clear till now this is clear that we have created this node and now we want to point it okay so what we will do is we will create a pointer okay we will create a pointer we will create a current pointer okay we'll create a current pointer and then this pointer would go we why are we doing this okay we can can we use the head itself yes we can use the head itself but i want to keep the head pointer as it is so i'm copying the data from head pointer to current and i will use current in my loop okay so i will write while current okay current next is not null while current next is not equal to null run the loop okay run the loop okay current equal to current next okay so what will happen is i will just move to to the the pdf okay over here over here what will happen is whoops i have okay so it's here so uh, over here what will happen is first current will point over here or over here okay so now inside the while loop yes it's next is the is the next of current null no it's not null so it will go over here okay is it null is the next null no it is not null so it will go over here is the next null no it is not null so it will go over here then it will check the condition here the next of current is equal to null so it will stop okay so this is the this is the last node okay so this way we will get the address of last node okay will get our uh, our last node and now our last node okay so our last node current dot next our last node will be equal to new node and then new node next of new node next of new node will be equal to null okay next of new node will be equal to null i am getting an error over here okay expected a semicolon okay so i have restarted the kernel okay or restarted the visual studio code so this way this way we can uh, we can insert at the end okay now let us move down okay let us move down this was inserting at first okay and over here we need to return head okay so don't forget to return head over here inserting at end we need to return head so let me just write return return head okay return head okay so let us now write head equal to okay over here we had inserted at first so let us comment this out okay i have commented this out and over here we will write hey head equal to insert at end okay we will insert 101 at end okay now let us run the code but before we run the code let me let me have one more line over here okay one more line over here save it and then run the code okay so i am running the code okay. it's, it's getting compiled okay so over here you, you can see that we have got element 6 okay we have got 101 in place of element 6 so this way we can insert we can insert a node at the end okay we can insert a node at the end let me just remove all the terminals okay and over here over here in the traversal i will i will also print okay i will also 
give a new line okay i will give a new line new line character over here so it, it's i think it's backslash n okay it's backslash n backslash n okay i'll give a new line character and then let me run the code okay so i am running the code over here okay so you see that we have got five elements before insertion and we have got one element at last after insertion okay so this way we can we can insert at first as well as last now comes inserting at an index okay so suppose we have we have inserting at index so let us let us look at this case okay let us first look at this case inserting at a particular index okay for that i will create a, a separate linked list okay i will create a separate linked list let let me just remove erase this line over here and then create a linked list a separate linked list over here okay so this is this is a linked list okay and we will insert at index so our index as we have studied array so our index will start from zero okay it will start from zero so the the index of linked list will start from zero and it will go on increasing okay it will go on increasing so over here then let me give one more okay let me give one more over here so it's one two three four and five okay so we have a head okay uh, there is no way to insert okay we don't have a way to insert in the beginning okay at the first we have a separate function for inserting at first okay right now we are inserting in the in between okay in inserting in between and over here so what we will do is we will initialize it as 0 1 2 3 and 4 now we will run a loop which will start counting okay suppose suppose we want to insert a node we want to insert a node after 2 okay suppose we want to insert a node after 2 so it will start counting from 0 okay it will start counting from zero okay it will get initialized to zero then it will increase and then it will uh, it will check if it is equal to index e is is it equal to index yes it is equal to index okay yes it is not equal to index okay so as it is not equal to index it will move to next okay it will move to next and it will get incremented so over here over here this two is equal to index so it will stop over here itself okay it we will make it stop over here we'll make it stop over here itself now what we will do is first of all the next of two next of two will be this nodes next okay new nodes next so first we will point this yes of course we will insert the data but at first only in the beginning only we will insert the data and i am talking about the steps after insert inserting the data and now twos next okay we will just cross this twos we will uh, replace this twos next from three to this new node okay we will replace the twos next from this three to new node so this this will be the second step step okay so remember remember the sequence of the step okay first we will use first step and then the second step if at all if at all one of uh, both of these steps get replaced we will get an error okay we will not get the expected result so brainstorm on this particular thing and write in the comment section below why we will not get the expected result okay so let us move to visual studio code now okay and look at the insertion at index okay insertion at an index so over here I, I'll, I'll move down okay i'll move down i will just comment this out okay we will comment this out and first of all first of all we will 
we will write in the comment we will write in the comment insert at index insert insert at index okay insert at index and over here over here we will write struct node insert at uh, at end okay we will just copy this code okay we will copy this code and paste it over here okay let me paste it over here okay so over here we will type insert at index okay insert at index insert at index insert at index then we have to create new node yes we need to create new node okay then we need to initialize current node okay and then we need a we need a while loop okay we need a while loop but here we need to insert at index so let me first go to this okay let me first go to this uh, dsa whiteboard okay and over here suppose we want to insert okay we want to we want to insert this at two index okay second index so the node at second index will be shifted to uh, node at second index will be shifted to three okay so over here if we want to insert after two then we need to stop at two okay if we want to insert after two then we we need to stop at two then we need to stop at two whoops let me just yes then we need to stop at two but if if we are going if we are going to insert at two okay if we are going to insert at two that is insert after one that is to insert after one let let me just okay that is to insert if we want to insert after two okay this will be this will be there if we want to insert after two we will stop at two when we want to insert after two but when we are inserting at the second index if we want to insert at the second index then we it's just like saying that we need to insert after one okay so we need to stop over here okay we need to stop over here okay so we need to stop at 2 minus 1 that is 1 okay so that is the difference between insert after function and insert at function okay so over here over over here we will see insert at function insert at index function okay so it will also take int index okay it will also take int index now let us create a while loop okay while while i okay while int i let let us initialize int i equal to 0 okay so int i equal to 0 okay int i equal to 0 and then we will write while i while i while while i is not equal to while i is not equal to index minus 1 okay while i is not equal to index minus 1 just run the loop okay while i is not equal to index minus 1 then run the loop so here in the loop first of all we will point the pointer of current to next okay current to next okay and then current next next of uh, current okay we will we will point it to current equal to current dot next current next okay so current current equal to current next okay current equal to current next and then then what we will do is we will we will just point sorry i mean we will increase the value of i to i plus plus okay i to i plus plus so here we have pointed it okay we have we have pointed it and now uh, we have got the current node okay we have got the current node so what will be the first step okay first step will be that we write new node new node next new node we point new nodes next to next of current okay to next of current so current next and then we give current we give current next of current next of 
नेक्स्ट ऑफ करंट ओके नेक्स्ट ऑफ करंट टू न्यू न्यू नोड ओके नेक्स्ट ऑफ करंट टू न्यू नोड एंड देन रिटर्न रिटर्न हेड ओके रिटर्न हेड ओप्स वी हैव रिटर्न इट मोर देन वंस ओके सो रिटर्न हेड so this is the insertion at an index okay insertion at an index now let us move down okay move down and write head head equal to head equal to insert insert at insert at index insert at index okay insert at index first of all we need to give head so head and then we need to give data okay so data will be 101 101 101 and we want to insert it at index 2 okay so the element okay element we can say element 3 will be equal to 101 okay element 3 should be equal to 101 so let us run the code okay let us run the code okay we have got you see element 3 is equal to 101 over here so this way we can insert insert an element at an index okay if we want if we wanted to insert after an index if we wanted to insert after an index then we we must have done instead of uh, instead of index minus 1 it it would be index okay it would be just index now let us uh, let us look at inserting at a node okay inserting at a node is very easy okay so over here over here suppose i have i have a list okay i have a linked list let me first erase this okay let me erase this okay so i have a linked list over here okay so this is first node second node third node fourth node and fifth node okay so over here it is very easy to insert this okay because we have node itself we don't have to find the index okay we don't have to find the node from index we can directly pass the node okay so over here suppose we want to insert insert after this node okay we want to insert after this node so what we will do is we will just do the same things that we have done previously okay first of all we will insert data into this node okay that will be the initial step then the next step step will be to point the next of this node over here okay and then point okay point the next of this node to the new node that will be the second step okay that will be the second step so here we let me just make it null okay and i will just give n over here or n u l l null okay so this points this particular thing points to null okay so over here over here you see that this is very easy as we don't need to find the node we can directly pass the node into our function okay so let us move to our code okay let us move to our code and let us uh, copy this insert at index code okay so let let me copy this code Oh, till here. Okay, so I am copying it, and I I will just write insert insert after after node insert after node, and will paste the thing over here. Okay, let me just press Alt Z to enable the soft wrap. Okay, and over here we need head. Okay, first of all we need head. we may or may not need head but for simplicity we will always need head okay then we we need one more thing over here okay we we need we need the node okay so we can write p previous node prev underscore node previous node okay we need previous node over here oops i will just 
remove this problem okay so we need head we need previous node we need data and we we don't need index okay so i will just remove this okay so we need previous node as well as new node and let me let me just remove this also okay let me remove this from here now here here we will just write let, let me remove all the code in between okay okay so first of all we have uh, we have created our new node and then we have uh, we have given data into our new node okay and now is the time for inserting our new node okay so what is the first step we will write new node new underscore node okay new underscore node and next of new node next of new node next of new node will be equal to next of new node will be equal to next of the previous node okay next of the previous node so previous node previous node next previous nodes next okay previous nodes next so next of new node will be equal to next of previous node and then previous nodes next okay previous nodes next will be equal to new node okay so previous node previous nodes next previous nodes next next will be equal to new node okay it will be equal to new node and then we will return head okay so you see that we have done it it is very simple okay this code is really really very simple so let me just uh, comment this thing out okay so i will comment it out and over here i will create head okay i will write head equal to insert insert okay i need to write insert at node okay over here i need to write insert at node okay insert at node and over here let me type insert at node at node okay insert at node okay first of all we need to give head then we need to give where we want to insert the previous node okay so let the previous node be third okay we want to insert after third node so here it will be fourth okay element four will be there then we need to give the data so one zero one let us give data as one zero one okay now let us save it and then let us run the code okay so you see that before insertion this was the thing and after insertion you see that after the third node node it got inserted okay element 4 is equal to 101 so this was about insertion in a linked list that's it for this particular session let's meet in the next session thank you everyone